Hey guys, I am Coach Terry and I am here to talk to you about water and electrolytes and how important this little habit is going to be play in your health and wellness journey as well as your success with your ketone drinks. So we want you to drink a glass, a bottle of water as soon as you wake up in the morning. You are dehydrated from sleeping all night and the ketone drinks get absorbed quicker, easier and work better in a well hydrated body. So grab your bottle of water and drink that first thing in the morning. And then maybe while you're getting dressed, you're brushing your teeth, all of that. And then maybe 20, 30 minutes later, then make up your ketone drink. A little side note, the water that you put in your ketone drinks does not count towards your water goal. Now, if you are using the flavored Mitoplex and you're putting that in a bottled water and you're drinking that before or after your ketone drinks, that one does count towards your water goal. So a little trick to getting your water in is we do a 10 chug challenge. So whether you're doing it in a glass, in a bottle, you might be doing it in something like this where you're chugging it or you're doing it with a straw, it doesn't matter. But do a 10 chug challenge. So you're going to take 10 chug sips uh, before you set it down like this. I've got all, more than half of that glass done by doing one chug challenge. So that's one way to do it. Another way is if you if you're eat, drinking your drink out of your water out of something like this, figure out how many ounces it is, how many bottles of water do you need? Take that many uh, rubber bands. So I drink four of these a day of water. So I put four rubber bands on here. Every time that I finish it, empty it with water, that I pull one of the rubber bands off. So that's my challenge for the day is to get all four rubber bands done. All right, now let's talk about electrolytes. Electrolytes are basically your energy, energy source of your body. So if you kind of compare it to um, charging your car battery, when your car battery is fully charged, um, you turn the key, it turns on super easy, you put your foot on the gas pedal and off you go and everything runs very smoothly. Kind of the same thing with your body. Um, you want your electrolytes to be balanced and on target because that's when everything works together and you're gonna have the energy to do everything that you wanna do. When your body is dehydrated, it's gonna have a harder time using the ketones and it's going to hold on to everything. So it's harder for your body to release those fat cells when it's dehydrated. A lot of times you're gonna feel like maybe you're hungry and you might not really be hungry, you might just be thirsty. But if your body can't get what it needs through drinking water, it's gonna send you to the pantry, it's gonna send you to the refrigerator to get food if that is the only way that it can get enough water. Some of the first signs of dehydration is a dry mouth, chapped lips, feeling like you're thirsty all the time, headaches, nausea, that quick dip in energy, muscle cramps. Those are all signs of dehydration and your electrolytes being off balance. So we want you to work on your goals, get your electrolytes in every single day, and keep pushing that goal towards that gallon the closer we get to um, our fasting part of the program. Don't forget to drop your plan. Let us know what flavor ketones you are drinking and tell me what your water goal is.